The thing is that we have to understand that we are Allah's servants. We belong to Him and Him alone. He is our master. He can put us in difficulty and He can also take us out from it. And there is nothing that happens in life except that it happens with His will. And His will is with His wisdom. And He has sent us in this dunya for what? For a test. And trials in life, why do they come? To wake us up and to increase our reward. Now when we are in difficulty, there are two options. One is that we give up. We walk away. When will a person give up? When will he walk away? When he was not determined to begin with. He had no end, no destination, no goal in mind. That's when he will give up. Now the other way is that a person holds on strong and he says the storm will pass. He's determined and he's focused on the goal. And who stays strong? The person who's determined, the one who has a goal. Now some people, they live life as if they are driftwood. What is driftwood? Like a piece of wood floating in the water. And what happens to them? They're tossed by waves and currents of the day. They're tossed from one side to the other. One wave comes, takes them one way. Another wave comes, takes them another way. Such people, they have no goal in life. They have no principles that they live by. These people are losers. Why? Because they're not acting on life. They're being acted on. Whatever happens, happens. It's easy, do it. It's difficult, leave it. The torrent is going one way, okay, go this way. It's going another way, okay, go this way. Life hits them like waves of the ocean as one event rolls into another or one rolls in after another. So one thing after the other happens and they're just drifting from one, way, from one place to the other, one thing to another. Then there are winners, people who act upon life. They are not acted on. They attach themselves to meaningful purposes. They have some goal and they hold on strong. They're not like driftwood that is just shifting from one side to the other. No, they are like a ship sailing in the sea, through the storms, through the sunlight, through the night, through the day, through the cold and through the heat. They're going, going because they have a goal. Will they end up somewhere? Yes, they will. Life is not easy for anybody, but we have to see why am I living? What do I want? Where am I headed to? What is my destination? What do I want from this life that I'm living? Or am I just living because I'm living? I get up in the morning, I go to work, I make some money, I spend it, I become happy, I become sad, I go to parties, I spend the night awake, I sometimes pray, sometimes I don't, I do what people tell me, I buy what's on the flyers, that's it. This is what life is. What is this life going to bring? What meaning is it going to bring? So these are some important questions that we need to ask ourselves. How am I living? What am I doing? Do I want to get somewhere? What is my goal? Where do I want to go? What ends? What purposes are my choices leading me to? Is my life you know, meaningful or is it just going day after day, ending up in nothing? If we are clear about what we want, if we are clear about our goals, then come as it may, whether it's difficult or it is easy, we will reach our goal. Because when you have made a commitment with yourself, when you have decided that you want something, and you adopt a way, you adopt something in order to get there, and it gets difficult, you make it anyway. You do it anyway. ومن الناس من يعبد الله على حرف فإن أصابه خير نطمأن به وإن أصابته فتنة انقلب على وجهه خسر الدنيا والآخرة ذلك هو الخسران المبين